Many people associate a dog muzzle with an aggressive dog and think that the only reason to use one is to prevent the animal from causing harm to people, but there are many other reasons for them. While they are used for training and behavioral challenges, they are excellent for a range of purposes. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. This secret training technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. Reasons for dogs to wear a muzzle. 1. Preventing them from digesting things that could upset their stomachs when out walking. 2. Preventing them from eating the feces of other animals when out walking. 3. Avoiding them posing a risk to wildlife, even if they are only being playful. 4. Controlling their response to anxiety around the close proximity of other dogs or strangers. 5. Keeping your dog and the vet safe during veterinary procedures. Visiting the vets can be scary for your dog, especially if they are in pain. It can be difficult for them to understand what is happening to them, and they may feel threatened. Some pups resort to snapping, growling and even biting not because they are aggressive by nature, but because they are trying to show the vet that they feel worried, uncomfortable or scared. How to train your dog to wear a muzzle? It's common for dogs to reject wearing a muzzle initially. It can be a strange feeling for them and may even make them more anxious, especially when going to the vets. This is why it is a great idea to allow plenty of time to train your dog to happily wear a muzzle. Each dog will take to the process differently. Some will progress through the steps with ease, over a few days of three to four brief training sessions per day. For others, it will be necessary to repeat some or all of the steps several times before continuing on to the next. 1. Gently introduce the muzzle. If your dog seems worried by its mere presence, or if you've tried unsuccessfully to use one with them before, the vets give the advice to not to put it on them just yet. Simply place it on the floor and encourage them to touch or sniff it. Every time they do, reward them with praise and a yummy treat. Don't force them to touch it, though. Once they are happily touching and sniffing the muzzle and then looking to you for a reward, you can move on to step 2. 2. Encourage further interaction. Place a yummy treat, like a piece of sausage or cheese, into the muzzle and let your pup put their nose inside it and take the treat straight back out. Don't attempt to close the muzzle yet. When your dog is used to putting their nose in it, you can start using an action call name such as, muzzle on. 3. Hold the muzzle on without fastening it. When your dog puts their nose in to retrieve the treat, say, muzzle on, and then hold it on with the straps behind their head for just a couple of seconds. Then release it and let them take their nose out. Repeating this action gets them comfortable with having the muzzle on without the immediate anxiety of it being out of their control. Talking to them and telling them that they are being good as you do this can help them to relax further. 4. Fasten the muzzle around their neck. This time, work on familiarizing them with the clasp of the muzzle being fastened around their neck, without having it over their nose. Some dogs are uncomfortable with the clasp itself, and the noise of it fastening, so it's best to train them to relax when they hear it before proceeding further. 5. Briefly fasten the muzzle. Repeating step 3 but instead, fasten the muzzle whilst their nose is in it and then undo it straight away and let them take their nose out. Rushing this step will only undo all of the positive conditioning you have worked on. 6. Gradually increase the time it's fastened. Slowly but surely, increase the amount of time that they spend in the fastened muzzle. Remember to still always put treats inside the muzzle before your dog puts their nose in, and talk to them, telling them how well they are doing. 
You can also try to feed them a tasty treat while they are wearing the muzzle. If your dog seems uneasy, take a break and then start over again and you may have just been moving a little too quickly. The key is to not force any of the steps and condition them to only feeling positive emotions whilst getting them used to wearing their muzzle. Muzzles are an effective way of keeping both your dog and anyone they come into contact with safe, no matter your dog's temperament. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel, Little Paws Training, if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.